let's take a look at creating a proxy registration. Basically, a proxy registration is when you register for someone else. To start a proxy registration, I need to log into the ACE Web system. If you haven't created an account yet, you can go ahead and do so at this point. You may do this by using the Create Account button. Since I have an account, I'm going to go ahead and create and log in by clicking the login button. The next step is to choose the course you need to register people for. I'm going to go ahead and choose a business class from the business class list. When you're on the class listing, you will see two buttons, enroll yourself or enroll somebody else. The enroll someone else button is your proxy registration. When I click on that button, I'm given a couple options. I can go ahead and enter someone's email address that I need to register for the class, or if I've registered them for a class once before, I can choose them from the list. I'm going to choose and pretend that I have not registered this person. So I'm going to put in their email address and click OK. Because I've never registered this person for a class and they're not in the ACEWEB system, I need to give the computer some very basic information about this person. The minimum information will change from school to school, but generally includes a first and last name, their address, their city, state, and zip, maybe a phone number, and special needs. The required information will always have an asterisk by it. So I'm going to go ahead and put in my information about this person and once I've done that I can confirm and continue and on the enrollment card for this person I can answer the question how did we learn about this course and you can see the basic fee plus any other promotional codes or fees that might be for this course. At this point, I can proceed to checkout or I can enroll someone else in this course. Uh, I can also enroll into another course. At this point, I've created that registration for that person. If I enroll someone else in this course, they will continue to add on to my enrollment card so that I can pay for them altogether. That's all there is to it. Good luck.